Hello, Todd Profit here once again for Digital Tools 2, uh, making another set of videos for uh, different apps that we use in entertainment technology. Now, I can't remember this is either number six or number seven. I've recorded a bunch of these today, but um, the uh, one I've been waiting to do all day, and I just thought, and I, 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 there's a couple games uh, that I found online that had to do with tech or are found on 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 the iPad and I started playing around started looking I found more uh, so I had a little fun researching this the first one I want to show you is hands down one of my favorites of all time and I think it's actually got some good learning uh, it's got some good learning too which is oxb and every single time I click it on here and it doesn't do any good cuz it's on the iPad okay oxb is the um, app in which you use different um you just you make different connections and so what i'm going to i need to take i need to run a connection from here to here and that's how it sound and that's a little loud let me see if i can turn that down just a little bit okay so but it gets a little more complex as you go okay. so there's another one now we're going to have a converter we got to go from quarter inch or TRS or TS depending on what it is and then we go to XLR three pin okay now what's kind of fun is um, oops, let me go back here on XB let that one finish out um, I am going to go back here oh I want to stop I want to exit the menu play now let me there are a whole bunch of levels and I have gotten pretty far on this before uh, and there are, by the way, some hidden levels underneath if you once you complete all these. Um, but let's kick up to 42. They get more and more complex. So here we're starting with MIDI. Okay, and I've also found two. So we got MIDI here, XLR. Um, one of the tricks I'll tell you right now, my thing to do is to, I will go backwards. Okay, so we're going from a single to a double. For now, I'm going to go ahead and guess and say we are going to go to this one. And this one, and then we need a MIDI out. Go there. Hell oh, yeah. Boom. Done. Uh, working backwards. And I think this is a good troubleshooting app, too. I think it can help you uh, think about troubleshooting. So, again, OxB. Uh, OxB is available for Android and iOS. I found it for Android today and did a little dance when I found that. Um, I do think to unlock levels, it does cost. Sorry, I just can't remember how much it is off the top of my head. Um, fairly inexpensive, under $5, if I remember right. Worth every penny. And boy, if you just want some time and uh, working troubleshooting skills. The next one I'll show you is Par Wars. Par Wars is, as we're going to see here, by Mulvaney Studios. Oh, and I apologize. I had started, started it, and uh, it's redoing the intro. So it's going to show us the whole intro again. Um... Uh, Mulvaney Studios makes some other apps uh, that I've used. I apologize, I can't remember what they are off the top of my head. Some lighting apps and some other, I think a stage manager app as well. But um, a lot of good apps. Now, the fun part about this app is ads whenever you restart. So we have to wait 30 seconds for the ads. Um, I may take a second and blur this ad out when uh, when I when I get done. Um, just because, uh, well, for no other reason than I don't want to put somebody else's ad on my video all right so this will take just another second here another seven seconds and it will be done sorry about this we're just gonna wait for the ad to finish and you're just gonna see a bunch of blur because all right so I'm gonna close that out and you can play uh, it's got a whole bunch of different levels um, you can also buy new um, you can buy different uh, lights now I have bought the ghost light uh, I'm going to go ahead and hit go. Most, they're all 99 cents. The only thing I wish is because I purchased uh app, I wish the ads would go away. Um, I wouldn't mind paying five bucks for all these and get rid of ads at the same time. So maybe the developer will, will do that someday. Um, let me go back to menu. Let's go back to level. And it's pretty straightforward. Boom. And standby lights. And we're going to have a road case coming out with our chain motor and then yep you just move your finger around and then you're gonna shoot at things you're gonna shoot the different parts with the source 4 
This is kind of ironic that we are shooting pars, which are no longer a thing. You can get the gaff tape for um, to help get some lives back. You want to get the gels because it'll give you colors. Oh, and you can... Oh, sorry, they're 8-inch Fresnels. Now, the Gobo is my favorite because it splits up your... Um, splits up your, your shooting, which makes life a whole lot easier. I mean, come on. You cannot beat this game if you're a theater nerd or a lighter nerd like I am. Um, yeah, the Gobo is like the lifesaver. All right, and of course, I could play this all day. Oh, no. Oh, so the Blue Gel has different powers. Oh, I like the Blue Gel. I still like the Gobo better. So here comes back the Gobo. Because you just kind of sit here and shoot one side, then you shoot the other side, then you shoot this side. So I'm getting rid of some truss. And I'm sure they're not as powerful as a straight on hit, but I forget what the wrench does, but it does something cool. You get another Gobo. Get some more gaff tape just to get some more lives here. Get my wrench again. Get my gaff tape again. All right. I could play this all day, but I'm not going to make you watch all that. All right, so those were the first, those are the two that I had. Um, the other one that I had before today, I actually bought on Android first. Um, I got a new Android app and I was playing around and I found this, uh, and then I found the iOS version, so I could show you this. Turning HD, um, we'll go ahead and hit play. And it's just, I think it's gonna have ads here on the bottom. Um, oops, hold on, let me go back. Gotta start over again, because I messed that up, all right. Okay, you can buy purchases out of here. Let me restart this level. Tap to play. You can choose from three different chisels. And you can start to whittle it down to the right size. The key in this is just to follow that shape and make that shape. I'm going to switch to switch to this app, maybe. No. Not rounded. What's it going to do? Nah, I don't think it's any better than the other one. But the cool thing is, once you get everything carved the way you want, you come through with the sponge and you smooth everything out with the sponge. And then after that, you come along and you paint it all nice and pretty because it's supposed to look like. Um, they showed you a picture earlier of what it's supposed to look like. And then you hit done. And then it's going to look at it. Now work your stencil for the next one. And then it's going to say, You got zero dollars. You know why? Because I wasn't trying very hard. Fun little app. I have to say, a very, very, very fun little app. Okay, next one I want to show you, uh, another version of that is Woodshop. Um, downloaded it just for fun. This is the third one I tried. I tried another one earlier and I just didn't like it. I like I liked this one because I liked, I liked the different... This is just a little different shape to do and I liked practicing with my curved tool um, but then you can go in and with a little bit of an angle tool and sneak in there and get all those out I'm not very good at this but Okay, kind of close. Let me get done. Again, it looks like I can go in and sand it. Ooh, look how smooth that makes it. Oh, it's just a block. But you could do that with a real block, too. Going to hit done. And, woohoo! Oh, I was supposed to paint it. So, hey, I actually earned money on that one. Fun little apps just to kind of kill some time while you're waiting in tech. Um, next one, another carpentry app. This is a, a, a carpenter and... Literally, the name of the game is Saw. You tap, and it cuts. Now, you got to time it just right. That one gets me more time. You don't hit the exploding ones. And you see, I was just a little line off. And now, of course, it's going to give me an ad. Um, that was the first ad I had gotten. So I have to say, the ads weren't too annoying on that one. The next one is Color Mix. Now, this one, I have to say... Reminded me of an old app. I was looking for a different app. It's an old app called RGB, and it was a light mixing app, and you would have to try to mix the, the the DMX values to make a certain color, and it got harder when along. 
had it years ago, couldn't find it, but I came across this one. Um, and oh, looks like we're gonna get Sorry about that. Let's see if I can at least mute that. Um, we'll give it a second to get through its little ad here. Um, but what this is, this is a paint app, and you have to mix the paint. And I really want to show this to you, so we'll give it just a second to get through its ad. Again, apologies, I'm probably gonna blur this out. Um, just because I can. And how many more seconds? Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Okay. So hopefully this will be the right button. No. All right. I'm going to pause the video for a second. All right. I'm back. I got the ad to go away. Um, Actually, it's funny. It was, a, it was for an ad for a product that I just purchased. All right. So what this is, is so we're trying to mix pure marine here. And we just start by putting in a little bit of time. We'll start with some blue. And you got to fill it up to that line. So I'm going to go there. And then let's put in a lot of light. Oh, pretty close. Pretty close. That looks close. Maybe one more. That looks like enough. That looks pretty close. So I'm going to hit OK to the water line above the line okay a little more there all right now let's see a miss not sure what I missed there but I didn't do it I got the first level though um again color mixing app I think this is to me this is just just a blast and practice those sort of color mixing skills all right the next one sew it all right, found one for the costumers. All right, this one is exactly what you think it is, um, but you put your finger on it, and then you have to, whoops. This is level two. I passed level one, which was just a straight line. Hey, I did it. Let's try a new one. Okay, so we're going to go here and just keep sewing. Oh, crud. All right, nope, didn't do that one. Going to try again. Nope, I keep doing a spin. I shouldn't do a spin. I think I just need to bank hard right. Okay, and then... Okay, or bank the other way. Man, hard level. Whew. I just have to keep pushing it, that's all. I'm not going to pass that one. Oops. Yeah, okay. Yeah, a little better on the second one. It gave me one star for that. All right. That's enough of that app. Um, last but not least is a version of one I've played before, um, just not this particular one. Again, it's good for thinking about circuits and how to get things circuits. So we got electricity going here, and we got to start turning on some light bulbs so I'm gonna turn that one on that way that one on that way that one there right, so I gotta get that one going um, bloop, bloop. How about, oh, gotta get that one hmm all right this one is a lot more challenging So if I use this one though, that's what I gotta do. Uh oh, game over. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and try again. Oh, well, it's gonna be the first level. I'll show you the first level then, because um, it's pretty straightforward. There we go. So I did that one pretty quick. The second level, I know what I needed to do, but. Another fun app that you can play. All right. Those are my one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different uh, tech theater apps you can play uh, if you want. Thank you so much.